Venezuelan gang members taking over Chicago. You know, that's been a chatter going on around here. You know, it was a caller that called and said, it's gang members took over an apartment complex two blocks from O Block. Then a couple hours later, gang members released a video and said, ain't no gang members over here. They bring their ass over here. We gonna chase their ass down there. Boom, 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 boom. Boom their ass away from here. I said, that's kind of strong words. Then the Venezuelan gang members released a video showing that they do be walking past O Block. So we confused. What's really going on? Is it Venezuelans taking over or is it not? Well, citizens of Chicago start releasing videos saying, don't let that internet lie to y'all. Don't let the news lie to y'all. It is Venezuelan gang members out here taking over, doing all kind of wild stuff. It was a lady that called the police actually the other day, yesterday. Not three days ago, not five days ago, not six days ago, not 10 days ago. It's a lady that called the police that live in O'Block and said that she see Venezuelan gang members outside and they shooting guns. Well, that video and surveillance footage got leaked to the internet. We don't see nobody shooting guns, but we clearly see a lady, sounds like a mother, is calling the police saying Venezuelan gang members are out there shooting guns by their auto zone across the street from O'Block. Sarah's in Thrin on the city. Well, I'm going to call a shots fired at 6415 South on King. The grandmother's report shots fired at the location. I believe she saw maybe Venezuelan gang members shooting in the air. I'm getting multiple calls. Third district's on 57. Said, wow, you know. So for people who saying this is not happening, that is really happening, you know. I know it's hard to believe because a lot of street dudes don't want to go by O Block. A lot of street dudes don't want to go by the moral. The Venezuelans are over there. They said, O Black. Hey, 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 hey. This is old block. So they know about the building. I don't think they scared to be honest with you, you know. Um, not only did they shoot guns in front of old block, it's citizens releasing videos showing how they took over the beach, the South Shore Beach, which is predominantly a black beach. All of a sudden now that beach is filled with migrants and Venezuelans and stuff like that, you know. A lot of people irritated about that. They feel like, look, we can't even go over there and be on the beach and swim because there's 100,000 migrants over there. So, like I say, it's stuff going on in the city now. Do that mean that they're taking over? They're trying to kill people? They're shooting people? They're bringing gang members here? I'm not sure, you know. The police claim that it's a Venezuelan gang, uh, TDA, that's out here. Trans de Argarula or something like that. So, I'm not sure. But for the people that say this is not real, Shit, this is a mother that called the police that's across the street from Old Block. Anytime somebody from Old Block called the police, you know it's real. Like, come on, man, look. Anytime somebody from Parkway Gardens get to the point where they got to call the police because they don't feel safe, then you know that's some dangerous stuff. You know what I'm saying? That's why I say this is wow, you know. Some people say this one real. Some people say it's real. Then the citizens around the world, not gang members, regular citizens, start posting videos on the internet showing how the Venezuelans are taking over their community, how they gang banging, and they're not afraid of them old block guys. It's some people that told me the Venezuelans then hooked up with old block, and this is such thing as a Venezuelan BD, a VBD. Yeah. I got that you, I got a VBD. Wow, this is crazy, you know. And that's what I heard. I heard that they be drunk, they be screaming, sounding real wild. And I don't mean from the accent, and I don't mean the way that they speak. I mean that they're out here, they're extra angry, they're super drunk. Plus, with their language, it sounds super crazy now, you know, when they wild as night. A lot of people say you hear that screaming late at night, they be loud, super drunk, and uh, wild and them. And they catching ops. I was told that the Venezuelans are catching ops in Chicago. At first, when they came out here, people was doing their ass dirty, busting them all upside the head, robbing them. Now I told, I'm told that the Venezuelans are robbing people, up and blicks on people, and they shooting guns. How did they get the guns out here? I don't know, but there's guns everywhere. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm going to keep you updated on this. That's why I want to ask you the question. Do y'all feel like 
if it is been swelling game bangers taking over shooting guns and stuff like that that chicago needs to stand up and make sure that shit stop or do you feel like the police need to step in because a lot of people feel like them game bangers be out here shooting people every day catching opposite time for y'all ass to make sure this shit stop i want to know what y'all think man leave a comment just to help me true Parents and three on the city I'm going to call the shots fired at 6415 South on King. The grandmother's report shots fired at the location. We believe she saw maybe Venezuelan gang members shooting in the air. I'm getting multiple calls. Third district on 5-7.